Men, what's the craziest thing you've sent in a group chat? Everybody left the group chat when he sent it cause that boy was definitely getting in trouble. I, 20F, go to class with a monkey. Let's call him Brandon. Brandon is a frat boy straight out of all American. He's six feet, constantly sweaty, and as dumb as rocks. We call him a monkey because if we placed him in front of a typewriter it would take him 1000 years before he could write down his name. He was so stupid no one knew how he was even admitted to our university cause it's pretty selective. But on the first week of classes it became clear how. If there's one smart thing he did was make a group for the class. Even though our professor explicitly told us no class group chats were allowed, Brandon still made one and made sure everyone who was accepted verified their identity. Everything about the group chat seemed harmless until Brandon started chatting it up. It didn't matter what hour it was, there was always a message of Brandon at mentioning you to ask for answers or help for the canvas assignment that day. Nobody ever said no because we were always on our toes with that class because sometimes the professor would drop a really hard assignment that only like two people understood. In order to stay in the group chat you had to contribute something. But some of us were already thinking about just starting a new group chat without Brandon, but there was this looming fear that if he found out he would nuke the original group chat and rat us out about the one without it. It was too much to stress about so we just muted the group chat and answered to Brandon whenever we called on him. On the day of our final exam everyone lashed out on Brandon because of what he did. He texted the group chat good morning and just said a really vague thank you. After a couple minutes someone asked him what he was thanking us for. He thanked us for helping him during the semester and wanted to express thanks. For some reason him. Saying the word help triggered a lot of students and they called him out for making the group chat just to help him and others said that they deserved his credits too cause they basically did the entire class for him. Brandon being an absolute monkey brain said, I don't get what you all are so upset about but you should download this before our final, I found it last night. Some people were annoyed by him and told him no while a couple others just left. Nobody trusted the link he sent but I was a little curious if I'm being honest so I clicked it thinking everything would be chill. It took me to a Chrome extension called Study Buddy AI. When I DM'd Brandon asking what it was before our final quiz, he just said to hurry up and download it before the lockdown browser was activated on Canvas. I wasn't worried about the test or anything because I studied, but this was pretty stupid of me. I downloaded the extension and when I started the quiz I thought I was gonna get caught immediately. The extension just started filling out all of my multiple choice questions for me, and I was thinking oh my god Brandon just hacked my computer, I'm gonna get a zero or something. When I stopped the extension and actually looked over the answers study buddy put in, I was pleasantly surprised, all the answers were actually correct. I ended up getting an A on my quiz because I purposely got some questions wrong so my professor wouldn't have suspected I cheated with study buddy. When the class finished Brandon nuked the group and I never got to ask him how the hell he found study buddy AI, and why couldn't his monkey brain have found it sooner instead of asking us for every single answer.